All right, so um, what I created is an infographic on nuclear power. And um, this is one of those things that my students typically have a hard time understanding. And I don't know if it's something just because it's nuclear and they kind of get confused about it, but um, either way, for them to understand the concept of how nuclear power creates electricity uh, kind of becomes difficult. Uh, so in this, this poster, or this infographic, basically what I've done is just kind of broken that down for them. Uh, and so we start off with uranium. That uranium gets turned into a set of fuel rods. From there, those fuel rods go into a nuclear reactor. Um, there's a set of control rods that are used to control how fast fission actually takes place. Uh, and for my students, I really don't go into too much detail about what fission actually is just because for what we're trying to understand, which is how electricity is created, um, this isn't too important. But basically what I tell them that is that in this process, uh, atoms are being split, and as this happens, we create heat. Uh, well, inside the reactor, there is a bunch of water, and that water gets heated to the point where it creates steam. Uh, the steam then turns a turbine, which I always kind of explain to my students at the beginning, that a turbine is like a big fan blade with an electric motor attached to it. And um, so once that turbine starts spinning, it creates electricity. And then down here, uh, this is just kind of showing how water gets pumped in and leaves. So as cool water pumps in to kind of help control uh, the water temperature, hot water is also leaving um, and turning into steam in that process. So that's kind of just a real simple thing. Uh, with my students, if I were, you know, to use this or will be using it, uh, realistically, I'll create uh, another video that explains the process in a little more detail, just so they have an idea um, of the different parts and, and things like that. But uh, hopefully this explains what I did. And, um, and yeah, so thanks.